is it just me or probably it's just me but every time i get fast food i cannot help but think of rob and china rob kardashian and black china when they were getting chick-fil-a i think <laughs> it's like what these are my fries like honestly i'm trying to stay focused you must think i got to be joking when i say I don't think I can't wait. We're just gonna have to roll this angle for a second. But we are heading to, oh my gosh, I swear, I need to get me a freaking hot comb to smooth down these thick edges. I have the thickest edges in the world. And they need to be not super smooth to where I need to like sleep in them, but y'all can be a little bit softer. I swear it's like sitting on a pillow right here. But anyway, we are heading to get our nails done, toes done, and I think that's it. I already got my wax yesterday. Actually, no, two days ago I got my wax. And I forgot to film or get footage when I was in there, it was a lot of people in there and I just don't like filming when people are standing around. Yes, can I get a large number three with barbecue sauce? And a large chocolate frosty. A large chocolate frosty. Barbecue. Okay. Anything else? Yes. And then a medium number one with no double. Okay. With no onions and no mayonnaise. Okay. What's the drink? A medium chocolate frosty. Okay. Anything else? No, that's everything. Alright, so it's 
Okay, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it was twenty one twenty seven, so my change should be twenty eight dollars and twenty seven. I keep missing the change. It was twenty seven cents, so that's seventy three seventy seventy three cents twenty eight dollars. Boom, got it. Okay, y'all do that. Y'all do the math in your head for you get your money back, so you know you get the right amount of money back playing with me. I remember one time I gave somebody uh, 20 and it might have been like $6 or something. It was underneath 10 and he didn't give my 10 back. He gave me like three ones and my daughter was in the car. And I was like, excuse me, I gave you a 20? Why am I only getting this? And he was like, oh, my fault. I thought you had gave me a 10. I was like, oh, that's okay though. I said, see, Camilla, this is a learning lesson. That's why you need to know how to do math or you're going to walk away and you ain't going to get your money. Mm -hmm. Kids nowadays, they just, you pay something for $20 that costs $2, you hand them $5 back. Thank you. <laughs> no, not over here. But yeah, let me make sure I did my math right though. 50 and it was 21. 21, can you do something for me? 21. You're going to get a three and a seven so 73 cents so my change is 28 dollars 73 cents all right 20 25 26 27 28 y'all and i already threw the change in there but yes ma'am mm -hmm. i gotta do math i gotta do math all Thank you. Okay, you too, thank you. Barbecue in here. Yeah. Okay. Now, oh, I gotta finish reading vanishing half i'm skimming through chapter 12 so that way i can do my review what am i doing my review on i'm doing my review on chapters 10 11 12 13 and then is it 14 15 16 17 yes and then we are done with the vanishing half and we'll be moving on to our next book i will do another poll to see which book we're going to read um once i'm done but i should I get a hot comb now while I'm out or later? I mean, it doesn't look that bad. This is what it's like when you are natural, okay? Natural edges. Embrace the natural fluff. But when I be waking up in the morning, if I don't wear my scarf, y'all, I can't even think of something to compare it to. But my roots, they thick. All right, y'all. We are on our way back home. I got my food. Is it just me? or probably it's just me but every time i get fast food i cannot help but think of rob and china rob kardashian and black china when they were getting chick-fil-a i think <laughs> and he's like you're not gonna help out it's like what these are my fries like what are you talking about he's like yeah but you see it's slipping you're not gonna help out didn't you see me about to go down She's like, shit, I'm not your mother. You better put it in your lap. I can remember that scene verbatim. But that literally is me and my husband. Seriously, like she fumbled the bag. Anyway, that's my husband and I all the time. I remember the one time we were going to Chick-fil-A and he did not want to listen to me when I'm telling him because it was like in the middle of a plaza and he wanted to be going his way. I'm like, it's that way? And now he want to drive up the one way. We're going in the opposite direction. 
Oh, he irritated me. And then he, because he's mad, he want to be speeding on 50 and like a 10 mile an hour. He is just dramatic. Oh no, and then there was another time we had got, um, what did we get? I think we had got these wings. And I had got my chicken tenders and there was this Arizona ranch sauce. And he was playing around with the kids or something, trying to like make them laugh and stuff like that. And then for some reason, he wanted to do the most pulling into the gas station and literally whipped it into the gas station. The whole bag like flew out of my hands. <laughs> And he got sauce all down his leg, in his car, like on the floor mat. I didn't even say a damn thing. I did not say a damn thing. I already knew it was about to be World War III in the car. So I was just like, you know what, Shamir, just keep your mouth shut because he's gonna blame this all on you. Even though he had full control of the car, I'm sitting here in my seat and somehow he wants to whip it. I'm like, what are you doing? And he's like, wow, <laughs> wow. So then we leave out the gas station and go across the street to the car wash. You not gonna help clean? Why would I? Why would I help you clean what you caused? I sure didn't. I sure did sit there. I sure did. Oh, it was sauce on his um, Air Maxes. <laughs> He has sauce on his Air Maxes and then try to prove a point. And then like two days later, some had a whole new pair come in the mail. I don't care. You do the most. Nobody told you you need to be trying to make the kids laugh because you want to be driving fast and stopping, driving fast and stopping, and then whipping into the gas station, y'all. I have been like so calm these last few years. I have no idea. I don't know how I put, be putting up with this man. That's what my um, in-laws be saying. Like, I don't know how you do it with him because they know him. I ignore him. But, yeah. Fun story time. Yay. Your girl is home on time. I pumped at 10.50 this morning. And, y'all, look what time it is. 2.50. On time with it. Daddy changing now that he used the garage. Don't come in here and disrespect. Don't come in here and disrespect. <laughs> You're on the vlog. Say hi. Yeah, right. Go sit your ass down. Say hi. You make me mad. <laughs>